your lady and gentlemen, welcome back to Room YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I will be showing you how about creating the flower by using Adobe Eorize Freshday. In this tutorial, I will be use how to use the blending tool in this tutorial. So, for the highlight next coming up, I will be showing you at the following. Okay, let me see. In this highlight preview for the original on the left side in the star. After that, we will change and using the blend, blending tool become to a flower look like this. That's highlight preview in this tutorial. So before we are going to watch for the next together, please don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the button. You will receive the notification whenever I have been the video clips into the YouTube channel. Okay, let me see together. Following. Okay, let's go. Go to here is the Rob Illustrator. For the template, create a new. Yes, for the places, break down the flower. Flower or any name, yes, you know. For the other places, no change anything, just like click create a new. Yes. Okay, in the template, before we are going to draw or create a flower, so go to a layer and select strokes none and the color. Select the soft blue, looks like this, and go to rectangle graph, go to on the top left and drag down to the bottom right. Okay. Click out of the select. Click here for the neck. Go to fill and select the color white. So that's go to the mesh tool. Yeah, leave now. Okay. Okay. For the black color, you can select and. This time by yourself, okay. Go to the layer and write out the black out. Black out. Yeah. Okay. After they have finished, lock here. For the next step, create a new layer. Write out a flower. Okay. Close. So. After we have finished the black card already, next step, go to the two in this one select the star tool, yeah. After that, go to the few select none and stroke. Go to select the color. Okay, any color, no problem. Up to you. Depend on you. You can select order. Okay. After select rule, go to the star and put down. In this kit for the radius, okay, you can uh, example 200 flips there, and the radius to 170. Okay, 4.20. Okay. Okay, in this case, you can select at just 20, 30, no problem. Okay, up to you. Okay, just like this, okay. Right now, the star is worth creating this already. So, for the next step, go to and adjust ship and go to the alignment horizontal, select the align center and vertical select right now the object in the center of the places already so next step select this one this time and go to the direct selection tool and then select the point and drag down here yeah, to create a curve is a circle Look like this for the next step. Go to the selection tool and 
make a small and scroll down uh, center. Okay. Okay, next step. Go to the three uh, star again. Select. In this case, reduce 200. 140 or 20 no problem okay adjust it will be 25 okay so okay in these strokes sorry okay select go to the strokes you can change the color here orange yellow okay up to you for the stroke color you can select so when we create a uh, star already for the next step go to the right direction tool and adjust the radius a little a little bit okay look that is similar to like this okay after that select two objects go to the alignment tool and select for the first one horizontal and the second one vertical okay the right now two star is overlap together okay for the next step select two object and this one and go to the object and scroll down go to the blend and go to the blend option in this case okay, you can the, select the specified step and the 100 gnv2 200 example 200 okay for the step if it's good enough you can change 200 300 400 so okay no problem okay up to you okay just like it's okay right now we have select the blends option already by using the step stage file okay for the next step go to the object again and this case scroll down and select blending in this case just only make a blend here yeah? blend and select make okay right now the star is become it nearly look like a flower already okay for the next step double click here yeah? okay double click here and go to the pens tool select pen tool and go to the center of the center of the flower and drag down of the flower select loop here and drag look like this okay down okay easy the Stra is become a flower a little bit. Okay, right now. Okay, it's good. Enter. Okay, if good enough, you can go to the backs once layer. Okay, right now, the layer is become. It seems to be like it's not good enough, so select and go to the object again, blending sorry go to blend and go to blend option we can we change the 200 become 400 400 okay simple you see the flower is a small if 400 is not enough go to gain up to 500 example we could not see a net so gain to 500 okay 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 in this case up to you up to you you can change 500 flips 300 no problem is it good enough beautiful you can stop and use this okay right now the first one is we cut a flower already so if it's so big you we, we can make a score make a small like this Okay. After finish, rags left, right. 
Okay. For the next, view be used the flower half drop shadow or list. Okay, select and go to the effect. In this case, go to the stylist. Select drop shadow. Okay. Okay. The solid kicks. Okay. Flower half drop shadow. Okay. For the next step, we will be duplicate. One flower become two, two flower. Okay. Select and go to the edit and copy and then go to the edit again paste in front okay we have to we have two problem okay select for the second one and go to the flips flips allies horizontal okay the flower is flip already okay right now to do join the first original so first original flower okay. Okay, that's all. I hope that this tutorial is useful for you. Finally, please do not forget to like, subscribe, and hit the button. You will be get the notification whenever I have been uploaded the video clips into the YouTube channel. Okay, see you next tutorial. Bye bye. Thank you.